Administrator of the Southern Zone of Tigray have to kill us, say some hard forces are still killing innocent civilians in six parts of the zone, even after the Pretoria Agreement. Nizam Kulan, Kabe Charcher Jamirnara, Yalamata Katamalamata, Ofla Koram Zatas Bahala or Dahat, Bumul and Abidzium, Zom Hail Tatizium, Yamzalo. The whole Charcher. Raya Lamata, Lamata town, Ofla, Korem, and Data districts are fully occupied by Amhara forces. They continue committing atrocities. Detention of civilians is continuing. I know elders and innocent kids who are in prison because their families are in Macho, Mohoni, or other parts of Tigray. After Kiros, note that Amhara forces are putting the Pirator agreement at risk. <laughs> To put it in numbers, they have trained and prepared 1,500 militants in Raya Lamata, 729 militants in Alamata town, and very recently, 612 militants entered Cherchar in a time we set this as our prior agenda. In Ofla, 322 militants, in Koram, 72 militants, and in Zatsa, 22 have been deployed recently in a new wave. Without the source of this militantis, as to my knowledge, it is not allowed for every individual to possess gun now. If so, I say it is coming through Eritrea to the Amhara region. This is very clear. The zone administrator underscores the people of Southern Tigray should not have been murdered and displaced after the peace agreement and calls the federal government to return the ADP's home and for the right of the people to protect it. <laughs> Federal government is accountable on this matter. We Tigrayans are saying nothing, but for the status quo to be kept, we are saying the territorial integrity of Tigray should be restored constitutionally. This has no excuse. It is too late. The administrator calls the forces trying to create conflict among the people of Amara and Tigray to abstain from their vicious acts. He also thanks and calls the residents of North Wolo and Wagamara to strengthen the good things they are doing. <laughs> The people of Kobo are saying we don't need to fight. That is exemplary to others and they should strengthen it. We live together and it is good to create people-to-people -people solidarity.